Hello, this is Kanspaloo, and welcome to more Let's Play Final Fantasy V! Last time we defeated X-Death, hopefully forever, and we got thrown into... Tycoon, somehow. Uh, now we are gonna go exploring a bit, cause we don't have anything better to do. Pretty much. Pretty much. Um, I guess the meteor is being cleared out? Maybe. Maybe I'm not even over there yet. Uh, wait. Wait a second. The terrain here does not match my memory of how it was before. And no one brought it up that it was different. I mean, I still have this weird map. But, I'm not really sure what's up with that, to be honest. Hmm... Hey, it's Baco! Hello, I'm Kryl. Huh? You speak Chocobo too? Of course she does. Just a little, I think he wants to introduce us to someone. Huh? For real? This is his wife, her name's Coco! Coco, you stud you! Listen, Coco, I've got a favor to ask. He says he already knows. What? He says you're leaving on another journey, right? Bucko, is that okay? I know you got the little woman and all. Oh, hey. What's he saying? He says that he loves her. Slick. And that while he's away to take care of the babies. <laughs> babies! <laughs> Coco has little ones on the way. She says she'll be waiting here for him. Coco, thanks. I, don't worry, he'll come back safe. Or else. <laughs> Wait, I'm curious though. What else is in the cave? Hmm. Is the pirate fortress still here? Like, I'm legitimately curious. Well, it all looks the same. Uh, empty treasure chest. Secret door. Goes into the middle of the mountains. Another door. Pirate fortress! She says to take care- there. Thank you, Coco! Once you get used to looking at them, chocobos are pretty cute. Wonder when chocos chicks be due. Years ago, me grandpappy finished a small lass for the sea. She kept calling herself Farifa. Oh no, fished. So he named her Ferris. And I guess that's how Ferris ended up with the pirates. Yar har fiddle dee dee hick. Okay, ah, uh? what is that? I, it might even be something we've already seen. I don't really remember. I he hear tell that the captain was really a princess of tycoon. Ah, uh, I still be seasick. I soon be tasting the rainbow. What? See? That Baka birdie healed up just fine. Fine enough to make himself some kitties, eh? <laughs> Those quakes must have opened up a path to our cove from the outside. Arr, We be pirates and do as we please. We'll hold down the fort while the captain's away. Ha <laughs> ha. 
Okay then. Well, let's go hop on Baco, then. Maybe we'll finally be able to figure- Move! Okay. Okay! Let's- let's get out of here. Let's go. Are there actually just no monsters in here anymore? Because I would believe that. I mean, I haven't run into any. Not, it's not like anything in here would have been a remote, stood a remote chance against me anyway, so... It sort of makes sense for them to just remove them. Although, come to think of it, I didn't encounter anything on the world map either. Maybe the encounters are just turned off while I'm missing half my party. That's actually a possibility. Okay, let's see. I was told... Oh hey, Bako can swim. At least in rivers. Okay, so I'm gonna save because I was told to look up th this river. And... I'm a suspicious sort, so I sus- Is that Big Bridge? I guess it is the geographical location for it, but... Okay, well clear- Let's stop beating around the bush here. Clearly the two worlds have fused. Because big bridge, different map, it sort of matches up. So what I'm wondering is, how the hell did this happen? I mean, come on. What the hell actually happened here? I just don't know. Hmm, well I was told to look at the river, but there was maybe this river. Yeah, there's clearly nothing here. Hmm. Well, whatever. And it, oh hey. Oh hey. Where even am I? Um, I don't know. I can, it seems I have access to a pretty large portion of the map right now, so I don't want to get lost. Can I get Lena and Ferris now? Oh, the bank was still in full swing. Can't you hear the ruckus? I take that to mean, no I cannot. Well, the most obvious place to me to go is this way. As there was- okay, I can't actually go any further this way. So much for that! Okay, plan B. North it is, I guess. Let's see, let's see, let's see. Um, what is over here? Nothing. I already knew that, so up here I guess. There's no other way to, really to go. Um... Oh hey, is that the pirate cave? I do believe it is. Wasn't this all ocean before? Yeah, it was like an inland sea, I'm certain of it. But there was a town around here somewhere as well. Oh no, it was this sea. I guess it moved, or maybe it just got smaller. It got smaller. Oh wait, there was like... I can't reach the town that was on here, but... Well, that's the floodgate, or that's the uh, way out. But I can't go that way, either. Ah! I'm running out of options here. I can't go there, and I can't... You know, there's no way that pirates, those pirates can reach the sea. Oh, I can go over here! Is that my airship? Oh, I'm so close! I'm so close! And yet, so far. But, you know what? I can reach the town! Yay! Uh, maybe this was the river. Well, I still don't see anything. Um, I can go further. But, who even knows is over there? Let's just, uh, visit here. I haven't been here in so long. Dancers! The leader of the pirates was the Prince of, of Tycoon? Unbelievable! That definitely explains something, though. Whew! Haven't seen any pirates around lately. Why don't you have a seat, big boy? Then, just keep your eyes on me. Tee-hee! 
I'm not look. I'm not looking at anything. You perv, get your mind out of the gutter. You say so. Mmm, for you, honey. We've got something special. Have I shown this before? I wow. I don't even know if I've shown this before, but you know what? Wow. <laughs> and now we're gonna reach this. I may have even played this one already, I don't remember. I guess so, because I didn't level up. Um, this was Ferris's room. So this is where we, well, anyway. Let's just, um... look around a bit, I guess. Some strange cave appeared to the west. I hear tell that there was some mutant turtle in there! Mutant turtle- that must be the gill turtle. Uh, which still terrifies me. So, let's not go there. Anything new? Not even close. Although, I could buy some tents. Okay then. <laughs> Hmm. I suddenly felt dizzy. When I came to, everything around the village had completely changed. But not any of your shops, I see. Ah, well. I wasn't really expecting anything new, to be honest. The wind stopped. The sky's stagnating. What? What? That seems like an old clip. Some folks saw a ship with propellers down south, and the bird-shaped peninsula. Wonder what the heck that that it is. Eh. Cannot speak. Whew, this wears you out. I doubt you have anything new either, but... Yeah, didn't think so. No point in checking the armor then. But I should go in here. Howdy, I assume you're new to this venture thing, right? Uh, not really. Well, fine, I'll learn you something good. The freelancer job can equip anything, and mimes can equip any armor but ribbons. However, they aren't e that strong or powerful magically, so they seem pretty weak compared to other jobs. That said, once you've mastered the other jobs, things will change. Once a job's been mastered, the pluses to stats and inherited abilities are added to the base stats and abilities of freelancers and mimes. Really? I didn't know what added to mimes as well. I knew the freelancer thing. Uh, for example, knight, black, mage, and thief. Freelancers that have the same strength, magical strength, and find passage and sprint. Plus, you still have two free slots for other abilities, which is pretty cool. Yeah, that's more or less what, how I thought it worked. Okay, so you're not gonna let me in, but oh well. I, I still learned something new about the mimes, so sure. Uh, let's go here. I can't believe Princess Sorisa was leading a band of pirates. Mr. Er, Miss Ferris, or whatever she was calling herself, what a shock! Still, it's wonderful that both princesses returned safely to the castle. Okay then, um, right. Well, I guess we'll just have to keep exploring, because this was a- this town was a bit of a dead end. I mean, some interesting new dialogue, but other than that... Hmm... Oh hey, this is new. What's gonna hap- oh. Of course that would happen. Excuse me. Ow! If you hadn't been riding so fast. Ah, always a backseat driver. Voko, I say it's all your fault. Don't take it out on him. He There's nothing he could have done. Uh-oh. 
parts. What's that? That's an uh oh. Antlion? Wait, haven't I fought this before? I think I fought this before. And I don't think it can act, act, it's actually very dangerous to me. Uh, although I've been wrong before. Ooh. I might be in trouble. <laughs> although I don't think we would they would give us a boss that's too difficult without uh, when we're missing half our party. But if it can cut my level in half, then that is pretty scary. Um, wow, that's draining quickly. Although, Bart's defense seems to be holding uh, out pretty well. I really wish I knew how much HP it had. At this point, it's actually a good thing it's only targeting Bart's. These Kraus can still deal good damage, and Bart's has had his damage lowered so much that it's diminishing returns. And I had to jinx it. I just had to. Oi. Okay, hopefully I can just... It ran away. I got 5 AP. Stuck in a monster's nest. Great. Just great. I don't think it's very great at all. Now what do we do? What indeed. Um... I know, let's use a high potion. That'll solve everything. Nope. That doesn't seem to have actually gotten us out of the hole. Um... Is that a rope? This is so mean! Is there anything here? No. Ha! Ah! Chocobos can jump pretty high, can't they? Oh, or that could fail. <laughs> Somebody is tormenting us. Do you promise never to try and pull something like that again? I bet it's Lennon and Ferris. Willing to admit you were wrong to try and make it without me? <laughs> Come on, get up here! Yeah, it's totally Ferris and Lena. And up we go! Um, there she is. Which one of you decided to maroon me back there? <laughs> Try it again and you'll swing from a yard arm! A what? But what happened? Why'd you come after us? I'm just not cut out for being a princess, I'm afraid. Pardon's much more my style. And what is even going on with that? You know, I've long since given up on trying to get anything that sounds remotely appropriate coming from Ferris. Uh, or coming from me trying to come, trying to say Ferris's lines. <laughs> Close enough. We still don't have Lena, though. Ouch! What's wrong? Owie, I think I got a splinter. Don't worry about it. That is... Why the hell would they bring that up? I mean, well, it might... It's probably just a... Hmm... Is that nothing? Hmm... Anyway... 
Uh, okay, we can't go any further. Oh no, we can go down. It's a cave with the gill turtle. Um, we still don't have Lena. So, you know, that's a thing. Uh, water? Maybe the gill turtle is- Oh, it's not the gill turtle, it's the sage guy! Somebody put him on his back! Guido! Ali, you? Oh, thank you. I suppose you can be helpful after all. The shock of the two worlds merging send everything topsy-turvy, including me! I'm a bit too old to do much on my back, Iru. What do you mean, worlds merging? I see you're just as slow on the uptake as before. It's an ancient legend, but I had never imagined it was true. According to legend, a thousand years ago, Bart's world and Kryles were one and the same. The same? That's what the turtle said, Bart's. It seems there is quite the echo in here. I know, Guido, right? But why did the world split? To seal the void. What? I fear no matter how often I allude to your ignorance, my dry wit just goes right over your head, so I will simply explain. That's probably for the best, Guido. Once a thousand years ago, there existed a presence of the strongest evil, Enuo. Enuo possessed the power to control the void. After a long and harrowing battle, the people were able to defeat Enuo with the twelve legendary weapons. However, the void that Enuo had created could not be erased. As a last resort, the people split the crystals in two. To maintain balance, the world split in two as well. The void was sealed within the space between the worlds. The interdimensional rift. That means X-Death was telling the truth. He really did want to return the world to how it used to be. However, without the crystals, the wind's power will never return. Nor will that of earth, fire, or water. You know, I don't think the earth crystal has actually been shattered yet. Just saying. Ouch! Oh, the splinter really hurt- Okay, what is up with the splinter? If bringing it up once could have been- Nothing, but twice is not. Is she poisoned? Is it a poisonous splinter? Because you know that's happened- Oh, I don't like the sound of that. Huh. Well, I know he's a tree, but... Really? <laughs> I turned myself into a tiny splinter! WAITING JUST FOR THIS MOMENT! NOW YOU CAN UNDERSTAND MY TRUE GOAL! TO MAKE THE SEALED POWER OF THE VOID MY OWN! What? You talking crazy, x -Death. Even for you. And that's saying a lot, seeing as you're a tree and all. WHY DO YOU THINK I MERGED THE WORLDS TOGETHER?! <laughs> what is happening? Uh oh. That can't be good. Now that the two worlds are one, the interdimensional rift, the void was sealed within is appearing as well. I butchered that sentence, but oh well. Wait, so in plain English, you're saying that this void whatever is coming here? Yes! yes! 
The Void shall be released from its thousand-year prison into my keeping! The matchless power of the Void will be mine! Not a chance, Xdeath! Um... Hmm... Castle Tycoon! Lena! Oh, that's bad. That's really bad. <laughs> to the Windrick, I'm guessing. Ah, uh, what? Beautiful! Beautiful! Look! Gaze upon the unlimited power of the void! Watch as it engulfs all in its path! And soon, it will belong to me! Lena! Xdeath! You! Yeah, just, just stand there, why don't you? Peons! Tremble before my might! <laughs> uh, what? Time for your viscera to see the light of day! Seriously, what is that? It's not the first time he's made that comment either. Is that like an organ or something? Now die! Saved by a turtle. Turtle! Wow, that's a quick turtle. Turtle versus tree, who wins? Well, seeing as one of them is the main villain of the game, I think I can guess who. Not bad! For a reptile! You think I sat around seven centuries munching on pizza? It's a Ninja Turtle reference, ha! Ha ha ha! Perhaps you should have taken the chance! You shall find no such tasted e diversions in the afterlife! Eh. Excess voice, it's loud and hard on my throat, but really fun. And honestly, I've done voices that are harder on my throat, so. It's just because of the volume. Um. Uh, also, what just happened? Peons! Trouble before my might! <laughs> it's probably also partially because I'm sitting down, actually, come to think of it. Which, you do have more oomph in your voice when you're standing, so that's probably part of the reason x -Death is hard, because he has a lot of oomph. Oh well, whatever. Ah, my Aiken! Guido, are you okay? X death of that cur. Well, he's a tree, so I don't think that's technically correct, but I digress. He must be stopped before he obtains the full power of the void, or. Hmm? By Jove, what's that? Just the ancient library of the ancients? The e fabled library of the ancients? My dear boy, have you any idea what an important place this is? Oh, of course you don't. Do you think the Library of the Ancients was here the whole time? Now Gita's getting it. Just assume Bart doesn't know anything. Um, l follow close, children. Within the library is a book which inscribe, which ha, which describes rather how to defeat X Death. Well, half a book anyway. But I know where the, but I think I know where the other half is. Sage Gino! What? Oh, scholars from Surgate. We have been able to find the second half of the sealed tome! Perfect! This is, this is a long episode, 
Oh well. Oh well. What you gonna do? It seems appropriate. What? Seriously? Now, let us begin the strategy meeting. Sages from two worlds. As you have probably noticed, the two worlds have recombined into one. Also, the Void is trying to break free from where it has been sealed within the rift. Then we'd better stop... Then we'd better hurry it up there and stop it. Barts, barts, barts. So enthusiastic and yet so stupid. Along with the Void, many fearsome monsters were sealed in the rift a millennium ago. They're all incredibly evil and incredibly strong. So you're saying that Ultima Weapon or Atma Weapon or whatever the hell is called in this game is in the rift. I got it. I feel safe in saying that as you are now, you kids wouldn't stand a chance. Then what do we do? Elementary, my dear Barts. The legendary weapons used to, to defeat the warlock Enuo a thousand years ago. The legendary weapons? Sometimes I wonder if you say things like this to spite me. <laughs> yes, the 12 legendary weapons. They are weapons. They are legendary. There are 12 of them. Now that we have both halves of the sealed tome, if all goes according to legend, and I am certain it will, the book will show us the way! Ta-da! Oh, bad music. The book? It is written. Sorry. When nothing's power again does speak peak. To light warriors this book shall speak. Okay, so th that's the power of the void. When it becomes a thing again, it talks to us, the light warriors. The book begins to speak. After Enuo's defeat, the weapons of legend were sealed within the castle Kuza. To break the seals, four tablets must be assembled. One rests aside spirits of the past blessed by the soil. One rests within an island shrine, kissed by wind. One rests beneath the ocean's floor, engulfed by flames. One rests beyond the river's torrents, protected by water. Along with the keys to open the seals, the four tablets are sealed our servants. I'm guessing four summons. Probably, let's see, Bahamut, uh, Leviathan, do um, you know? I'm not sure what the other two will be. If the tablets are moved, our servants will awaken. The ultimate spells of white and black, the magics of space and time, Meteor, the Sea King Leviathan, the Dragon King Bahamut, also Holy Flare. Um, okay, present this book unto the gate and the way to the seals will be opened. What's the gate? Hmm, I wonder. Receive the sealed tome! Okay then. Go unseal the 12 legendary weapons before x gains the power of the void! We're all counting on you. Go and find the first tablet, blessed by the soil and the spirits of the past. Eureka! It must be the pyramid in the desert of shifting sands! Ferris, Kryle, and even you, Barts. You must go at once! The future of the world depends on it! Well, if the turtle says so. Hopefully Lena uh, will join us soon. I don't for a minute think she's dead. I mean, well, frankly, they would make a bigger deal out of it if she was dead. Um, that's just all there is to it. Now, that said, this is a really long episode, so I'm going to save and cut off here. Um, 
Until next time, this has been Let's Play Final Fantasy V with Chaos Blue, and have a nice day.